pani and we are going to make butter pani here are the ingredients so friends this is paneer which you can buy in small packs like this and we have cut it into tiny cubes just like this and this is also called known as cottage cheese so let's get started by adding one teaspoon of ghee into the pan let's add half of the onion to the pan some cashew nut oil and the tomatoes go in garlic let's fry this for about 5 minutes in the meantime let me sprinkle some garam masala on the paneer ok friends we are done now and we need to grind this into a lovely smooth paste Okay friends, the page should look like this and now in the same pan, we are going to fry the paneer cubes for 2-3 to three minutes. Let me sprinkle some garam masala over this. Let's flip this over now. The reason for stir frying it is because the paneer is very very soft. So by frying it, it will get hardened up and it will not break while cooking it. So let's get another pan and add one teaspoon of ghee. Let's add in the onions, the curry leaves, the pandan leaves, the garlic, and it is a finely chopped garlic. Cinnamon, cardamom. Chili flakes to go in, chili powder, turmeric powder, garam masala, and let's give this a good mix. Yes, I And let's add in the tasty matrix. Let's fill up the same cup with some water and add it in. And friends, at this point, you must switch off your flame. I have 2 tablespoons of Greek yogurt here and I'm going to be mixing about 100ml of cooking cream and we're going to add this into the curry so that it will be more thick and it will give a good taste Let's add it in now Let me add in 1 teaspoon of salt in here 1 bay leaf and we'll mix this up and at this point, you can switch on your flame. Time to add in the paneer now. Because it's butter paneer, let's add in some butter now. Time to add in the coriander leaves now. You can switch off the flame now and we're ready to eat. Okay friends, you can garnish this dish with some fresh coriander leaf and some paprika powder. It's ready to serve on the table. And I am ready to eat this yummy dish. Mmm! This tastes so good. Let me try it. You guys must definitely try the recipe. So don't forget to like our video and share with your friends. Until we see you in the next video, bye!